Logan here for Backend.com, and today we're going to be comparing the Dyson DC44 and the Hoover Air Cordless Vacuum. At the time of recording, this vacuum retails for $399, and this vacuum retails for $299. These are both aimed at assisting you in between major cleanings by providing a cordless way to clean your house. Just get up those quick spills so you don't have to pull out the big vacuum. Um, this vacuum right here lasts for about 15 minutes on a charge. This vacuum right here lasts for 25 minutes on a charge. However, they provide two battery packs in the box, so it has an effective runtime of 50 minutes. They both do a great job of cleaning, but let's do a little comparison and see how they work. First of all, there's some obvious big differences between the two. If I detach the Dyson from the wand here, you can see that the Hoover has about three times the bin space of the Dyson. However, the Dyson does have a much better filtration package with much smaller cyclones, meaning you have to, uh, you have to wash the filter much less often uh, every three months with this machine versus every 10 uses with this machine. And they also have different ways of working. With the Dyson, all the weight being in your hand and then having the pole attached to the motor so you hold it up, whereas the Hoover balances on its own and then all the weight is on the floor. Uh, the Dyson does a much better job at attachment cleaning, being that there's no hose, you have the motor directly in your hand, and you can just put an attachment right on the end, or on the end of the wand, and just use it anywhere. Whereas, with the Hoover, you have to take the hose here, out of the back, and you can either have this little short hose here, or you can flip it in to the wand, and if you can get the wand off easily, then you have the wand, but you can't pull it too far, otherwise the machine does tip. But let's take a look at how the two compare on the carpet surface. So today I'm going to lay out some oats between the two, and we're just going to do a quick pass back and forth and see how well we can do this. I'm just going to use the uh, lid here, a little informal measuring gauge. Yeah, that looks be one, that's going to be for the Hoover. There we go, and that's going to be for the dice. Yeah, spread those out. Okay, maybe a little bit more for the Hoover, make that equal. There we go. Now let's go uh, back and forth one pass with each and see how they do. First up is the Dyson, and we're going to be using this in max mode, and we're just going to give it one pass back and forth, starting in three, two, one. All right, that was five seconds there. And we're going to do that again with the Hoover, after we convert it back down to floor use. And the Hoover doesn't have a max mode. So, we're just going to be going back and forth, and we're going to get that started. All right. So, uh, that was five seconds for both vacuums, and they both did a very good job. However, when you get down on the floor, you can see that the Hoover did a much better job, and we're going to zoom in and show you a little bit of that. All right, here we are with the Dyson, and if we zoom in, you can actually see a good amount of oats that were left on the floor. You can see right in here all those oats that were left. Now, if we move over and look at the Hoover side, we don't see those left behind oats. And the carpet looks nice and clean. So, there is definitely a little bit left behind on the Hoover side, however, not nearly as much that was left behind on the Dyson side. 
So overall, in this situation, the Hoover Air Cordless 3.0 did a much better job at carpet cleaning compared to the Dyson DC44. So overall, the Hoover Air Cordless did a better job and is $100 less. So if you were going for attachment cleaning, the Dyson would be a better bet due to the uh, attachment system on the Hoover Air Cordless not being very good. However, if you're going for carpet cleaning, I have to say that the Hoover Air Cordless does a better job at a lower price. You could read more on Vacman.com or by watching my channel, Vacman on YouTube. This has been Logan here from Vacman. Thanks for watching. Hi, Logan here from Vacman.com, and today we're going to be comparing the Dyson DC44 and the Hoover Air Cordless vacuum. At the time of recording, this vacuum retails for $399, and this vacuum retails for $299. These are both aimed at assisting you in between major cleanings by providing a cordless way to clean your house. Just get up those quick spills so you don't have to pull out the big vacuum. Um, this vacuum right here lasts for about 15 minutes on a charge. This vacuum right here lasts for 25 minutes on a charge.